Well, it's something that doesn't happen very often. Family members running against each other in the same political race. But in a race for judge in Jim Wells County, it's the case of the exes running against each other. Our Michael Gibson spoke with both candidates as they battle it out to see who voters will choose. It's the battle of the exes here in Jim Wells County for the county court at law position. Jennifer Barrera is going up against her ex-husband, Rumi Solis Jr. Jennifer Barrera works alongside her father, Armando, who at one time was the district attorney for Jim Wells County. His daughter is wanting to be the next county court at law judge. If she wins the Tuesday primary race, she'll have the job. But standing in her way is her ex-husband, Rumi Solis Jr. He's a longtime prosecutor in the 229th Judicial District, covering Jim Hogg and Duval counties. My opponent is my ex-wife. I would say she's running against me, not me running against her. My opponent is my ex-husband. We were together for 18 years, married for 10. We divorced in 2020. It's complicated. When you drive around town, you'd never know their exes by taking a look at the campaign signs. Those signs always seem to be on the same corner, but usually, of course, separated from each other, except for here at the corner of Main and Stadium. The two stand side by side, even though in real life, the candidates don't. I can't speak uh, for my opponent's signs, but I have gotten a lot of compliments on my signs. Everyone would have to admit that Solis has some of the most interesting signs to be found anywhere here outside the courthouse. As you can see, they are full-size cutouts of the candidate himself. But the question he gets asked a lot is about that ex-wife. A lot of people approach me and say, hey, what's it like? You know, uh, your ex-wife is running against you, this and that, whatever. And, and I get it. I guess people find it, I don't know, interesting. Each candidate believes they're the best person for this job. It is what it is. I'm running because I believe that I'm the best qualified attorney. Uh, what's going to happen is uh, the results are going to come out in my favor and I'm going to be the next Jim Wills County Court at Law judge. Tuesday evening, we should know which X will come out on top in this race where there is definitely no love loss between the two. From Jim Wells County, Michael Gibson, 3 News.